Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a brief video on the new Michael Kors wallet that I just purchased. Um, I'm really excited to get it even though I already have three other, actually four other Michael Kors wallets. Um, but I'm really excited to get this one because it actually matches the new MCM bag that I just picked up about two weeks ago. Uh, if you watch any of my videos, then you'll know that I bought a bag because I did a video on it. Anyway, so, um, so I decided that it was time for me to go pick up another wallet because I have a few Michael Kors wallets already, but there's one wallet, you know how ladies or guys, you have that one wallet you always seem to gravitate back towards because it's your favorite, it's worn in, it's easy to use. So there's one wallet that I've had about six years. Um, like I said, it's Michael Kors. It's a black wallet. I love black wallets. And it um, was really starting to look bad, but I love it so much because it was really a pretty wallet, but also my son had picked it out when he was only about five years old. And he did such a good job at picking this wallet out to match the purse that I had at the time that I was like, oh my God, I have to use this wallet like forever. So um, yeah, forever didn't last but only six years because <laughs> it got to the point where when I started pulling my wallet out of my purse, it was kind of embarrassing because the wallet was starting to look really worn on the edges and just started looking really old and it just it didn't look good anymore um michael kors wallets last a really really long time but when you use that wallet day in day out practically every single day for six years it's going to start looking worn and used i mean that thing has been through the ringer it's been through so many purses it's been all over the place so um definitely needed to get a new one and like i said if you watched my videos then you know that I just purchased an MCM bag and I got the cognac color which has the black diamonds and the black logo on it. So I decided to go with another Michael Kors wallet because right now I just don't have the money to buy an MCM wallet. The one I want is almost $400 so yeah, not gonna happen right now. So I decided to go to the Michael Kors store and get one. They didn't have the one I wanted. I wanted a pebbled leather one this time. So I decided to go to the outlet center and I found the wallet that I was looking for there. So this is the wallet. This is the Michael Kors Jet Set Continental Travel Wallet. It's the zip wallet. As you can see, it has the beautiful gold metal zipper all the way around. This is a multifunctional wallet. It's also a wristlet. So it has the wristlet strap that is detachable. It has Michael Kors on, let me see if I can get this to focus. It has the Michael Kors name on it right here. Okay, it's not gonna focus. But anyway, so this comes off. I like the fact that the strap is not attached to the zipper. It is on its own separate D-ring. See it? It's on its own D-ring. So you're not using the, the strap to unzip the wallet all the time. So anyway, it has Michael Kors on the metal zipper pull. It has it on both sides. It's on the back side as well. And it's very, very plain, just, you know, your simple solid black wallet. It has the Michael Kors in the metal, uh, like logo right here. And then you hear that? Do you hear that zipper? That is so nice. Michael Kors are known for their wonderful zippers and the zippers are always metal. Their exterior zipper, zippers are always metal. And so one of the things I really love about the Continental wallets is that the travel wallets is that they open up flat. I love this feature. I love that it opens up completely flat like this and you have easy access to all of your cards. Everything that's in here is easily accessible. You can open it up flat and show someone your, you know, your ID if you need to. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. So it's a great wallet. Let me go through some of the features of the wallet. The interior of this wallet is Safiano leather. So even though I did not want Safiano leather on the outside of my wallet, I did 
like the fact that the interior was Safiano because it's going to make this wallet a lot more durable. It's going to last a lot longer than if it was a softer leather on the interior. So on this side you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait, I'm just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You have ten credit card slots on this side. So another thing that's nice about this is the fact that it has so many credit card slots. And then you have another six credit card slots right here. So 16 credit card slots total and um, 15 if you use this for your actual ID, which I normally do. So you have a compartment here. It opens up nice and big. It has the Michael Kors um, embossed fabric. And then there's another compartment here same thing on the interior of that, Michael Kors embossed fabric. There is a compartment on this side, very large compartment. Let's see if I can get a good view of that for you. Very big. And then over here on this, that's all on this side. And then over here on this side, behind these credit card slots and this pocket is all of this. So you have a compartment here. You have your zipper compartment, which I have it unzipped already. This zipper is a plastic zipper. Michael Kors interior zippers are almost always plastic and their interior zipper pulls are almost always leather. This one is Safiano leather, but it's a very, very good zipper. This tag is in the way. It's a very good zipper as well. And then there's, so you have that compartment, the zipper compartment. You have this compartment here. And then you have a very large compartment here. And as you can see, this, this back compartment has some width to it. See how wide that is? And that's because this back compartment is made to accommodate your cell phone. So um, I do have this very same wallet in Oyster in Safiano leather. And so I already know that my phone will fit in this back compartment very comfortably, along with all my cards, if I have every single one of these slots filled and all these filled and stuff in all these compartments and these, my phone will still comfortably fit in here and it will still zip shut completely and it won't look like it's, you know, stressed out or like there's stuff protruding from it. It's a great wallet. I love uh, how, how versatile it can be. And it is large enough to put your passport in, however, um, you would have to put it in like this back part here or possibly you would probably have to put it like here and it would not be able to have a case on it because this one isn't as wide as the other travel wallet that I have that is the MK logo one it's a little bit wider and it is made specifically for that purpose um, to accommodate a passport this one's not made to accommodate a passport but it will um, as long as you don't have your passport in a case. So, yeah, anyway, so this is the one that I chose to go with because I felt like it really matched the bag that I purchased um, well for the time being. And I know this wallet's gonna last for years and years to come. Michael Kors has great wallets. Their uh, quality is, ex I mean, it's just exceptional. I feel like you can't get a better quality even when you're purchasing items like Chanel or Louis Vuitton or, you know, even the MCM wallet that I want is not better than this wallet. They're not made better. They, you know, are going to last, you know, no longer than this wallet's going to last. So, you know, for the meantime, I'm going to use this Michael Kors wallet and I have the bag here so I can show you. So this is the bag that I did um, an unboxing on the other day, and I just feel like it matches, you know, it matches well enough. I mean, yeah, this is Michael Kors and this is MCM, but I mean, it matches because, you know, the bag has the little black diamonds on it, and so, anyway, serves its purpose. So this wallet is normally, let's get down to the price. It's normally, um, this one was an outlet wallet, so it was not at a boutique. It's normally $188, if you are purchasing it and it is not on sale. However, 
I did not pay that price for it. Um, they are having a massive sale at, not only on the Michael Kors website, but also at their outlet store, and they are giving you 60% off. So I got this for 60% off um, without tax. Before tax, it was I think $60, and I think after tax, it was around 64. So it wasn't bad at all. I felt like it was well worth the price. I mean, this is a wallet that I will have for years and years and years to come. And um, this will probably last me longer than my other Black Michael Kors wallet because uh, it's not that super soft, smooth, like glove, uh, I think the other one was like glove leather or you know that really super soft, it feels like lambskin. So it was destined to get worn um, prematurely, especially as much as I used it, so yeah. But this one I think is gonna last me a really long time, at least I hope so because I really, really like it. I'm really weird about wallets, like I will change bags all the time, but when it comes to wallets, I don't typically change wallets that often, and I always have one wallet I always gravitate back to, and it will more than likely be this one, because um, that's what I did with my other black Michael Kors wallet, and that's why it's so ragged looking now. It looks like, it's embarrassing. Anyway, so um, yeah. So this has been my review of the Michael Kors Jet Set Continental Travel Wallet. Um, oh, one thing really quick. I will do a review, if you guys want me to, of what all fits in this wallet. And I will try to also show you like how much can fit in here as well as your phone. I have a Galaxy S8 Plus and my phone fits in here very easily. And with all my other stuff, like I said, and zips up closed, I am still filming on my phone. Um, despite the fact that I did get a DSLR camera finally, thanks to my sister. Thanks doll. And, um, but I'm still trying to learn how to use it. And that's the reason that like all the packaging was already out of this wallet because I had done a trial run with my camera and I couldn't get it to focus. Like when I would put it close up like this, I couldn't get it to focus on the details of the wallet. So I do have a friend who is a, an audiovisual teacher and he's going to show me how to use it. So then I'll be able to, you know, film on my camera and show you, you know, that my phone actually fits in here easily. So, and then the quality of my videos will hopefully, you know, increase and, and get better. Anyway, so I hope this video was helpful to you. If you are on the fence about purchasing a Michael Kors wallet, I urge you to go ahead and take the plunge and buy one. They're excellent quality. They're going to last for years. Depend, I mean, no matter what, what um, material you decide to buy, if you want the Safiano leather, if you want the pebbled leather, if you get, you know, the lambskin ones, they still last a very, very long time. You're going to definitely get your money's worth out of it. Um, yeah, so please don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, leave a comment if you already have one of these wallets and tell me how much you love it or if there are things about it that you don't like. Um, I love reading the comments when uh, my you know, subscribers or anybody watching the video lets me know, you know how the video was helpful in, um, in having them you know, decide, helping them decide which one they decided to go with. So, uh, yeah, just, you know, let me know. Comment down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.